Ramadan, it's the uh, it's the month of fasting for Muslims. Uh, from sun up till sundown, we don't consume any food or water, so no solids, no liquids. Um, the whole point of Ramadan is really to kind of quiet your physical appetites and focus more on your spiritual self. So all year round, you're so busy kind of feeding your body, but yet you kind of neglect your soul. And the idea is for this one month, you go extra hard and flip it. So we ended up ordering like super exclusive like colognes and not they're not colognes they're utter so it's like uh, oil based scent but they're pure oil so the stuff lasts forever like you put it on your clothes and I'm telling you for weeks some one of my friends actually he what he did uh, he put some on his shirt and then left the shirt in his closet and I think it was like the next day or so he went to go grab something all of his clothes had like this beautiful fragrance running through it oh, man. so we've got we've got Tons. We used to rent in the 1990s and then we bought this place here. It was a Douglas Murphy drop in center. Before that, it was the MTT building. It was a warehouse plus two old houses put together. The houses were uh, 80 years old. And um, so we bought it and made it into a center, a mosque, a small little school. And then we went from there. When it was collapsing, we demolished it and we rebuilt it, is what you see now. And then we put solar panels and trying to go green and all of those things. And That's then, awesome. Yeah, yeah, you show me some of the yeah. uh, fingerprint readers upstairs right. and the, the smart boards. So it's look great. Like you guys yeah. are making something great here. Right. Um, I'm also uh, wondering a little bit about Ramadan. So we're going to be eating food tonight. Yeah. And I think everyone's exciting. So can you, can you tell us a little bit about Ramadan? Well, Ramadan is the month of fasting. It's, it's a pillar of Islam. So like other other uh, religious sects also follow fasting but of a different sort uh, the Christians the Jews many others actually fast and even now fasting is is good for health now they're finding out so that the body recoups and recovers and becomes healthier go on in your own normal day and then you break fast then you really also have empathy for the poor because how else are you going to have me and you have empathy for the poor we can go on a diet but we can't actually um, put it together this good while you really feel the pangs of hunger hit you at about this point when I'm talking that almost like 10 minutes away from uh, breaking the fast so when the pangs of hunger hit, hit us we know we have nice delicious food to eat this is uh, we have chicken biryani chicken biryani yes it's on the menu and then we have the meat kofta stew Somebody's <laughs> 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 <laughs>